speaker, what a way to start. <laughs> I took a trip recently to Icarus's runways, places where you set yourself up to fly, and then fly, and then, whatever, then for whatever reason, cease to fly. A desk with a half-written poem, with perfect rhyme scheme, and perfect tempo, and a perfect lack of passion. Piano with a half-written song, a masterpiece of no theory, has gorgeous chords that almost make up for the lack of meaning in the lyrics. Places I look at every week, see my friends walk in, yesterday even. Places we all visit in one form or another, armed with a pen, and someone wrote that the pen is mighty, but easy for him to say, he wrote it. He didn't doubt what he said. He didn't have to give someone else a piece of him. He didn't say it like they were his last words. And that's how we should live. And yesterday, among a random collection of calculus, doodles, and old poetry books, we cleared the runway, the one that belongs to my old friend Icarus. I flew using the combined knowledge of those pages. I'm taking caution, I flew. Not too high, not too low. I survived. It was horrible. I'd rather have flown high and fallen. I've done it before. It's so much more fun. And you can always undrown when it comes to falling like this. If I could have done it again, my inner Daedalus would have looked at my wings, thought about how we only have one life, showed his invention to the damn sun. Thank you. Hey, yeah.